Most Minnesotans are breathing clear air tonight, but as wildfires keep burning in Canada, those hazy skies are going to return. The Pollution Control Agency just issued a new air quality alert for northern Minnesota and the Twin Cities due to smoke and ozone in the atmosphere. It's a problem much of America faces this summer. How can wildfire smoke travel so far and how far can it go? Good question. Jeff Wagner learned that not even an ocean can get in its way. How does the skyline look today? Uh, today I think it's pretty good. It's not the clear blue when I first came here a month ago. At least it's not the gross gray bad for your health blend we experienced a few weeks ago. It was just hazy. I still went outside, although I was debating about wearing a mask. Wildfires burning in Canada have been sending smoke southwards, disturbing the air quality in American cities, often hundreds of miles away. Well, it's got to go up in the higher atmospheres. Why can wildfire smoke travel so far? I think the main thing that we're dealing with is just the sheer amount of smoke that's produced by these fires. David Brown is a meteorologist with the Minnesota Pollution Control Agency. A large wildfire can um, emit the same amount of fine particles in a day that like a coal fire, coal fired power plant might generate an entire year. The smoke can reach heights as high as five miles into the atmosphere where thunderstorms form. Once it's up there, why doesn't it just dissipate yet? And that air up there is usually pretty stable. Those smoke plumes can hold together and these, they kind of look like ribbons or bands as they move through the atmosphere with the swirling of the winds. From there, jet streams carry the smoke at times thousands of miles. It certainly is, is um, conceivable that it could go, you know, maybe halfway, quarter way around, around the globe. In September of 2020, wildfire smoke from California reached as far as the Netherlands, traveling nearly 5,500 miles. Weather fronts then pull the smoke down from the atmosphere, creating those sunsets bursting with color. But what we saw on the East Coast last week when New York City carried an orange glow and in the summer of 2021 in Minnesota was different. Instead of that smoke getting lofted really high up in the atmosphere, um, that that weather system or that cold front will come through and pass by the fires. And if, if we get smoke um, trapped in that, that, that can cause that smoke to stay really, really heavy, very close to the ground. The distance smoke travels in these cases is shorter, but the impact on our lungs feels greater. Jeff Wagner, WCCO News. The wildfires burning in Canada are having an impact as far as Norway. Folks there have experienced hazy skies and smelled smoke.